This is for Year 12 Specialist. It comes out of 9D, Applications of Differential Equations, question number 4. So we have an island um, of rabbits, and after the 1st of January 2010, due to a virus proportional to the square root of the population. So dp dt, where t is the population, is going to vary with some constant of proportionality, the square root of p, which means dp dt equals k root p. So from a constant of proportionality, I don't need that k there. Okay, so I've set up the differential equation. In this particular case, because I know that they're decreasing, I can say that k is less than 0 and p has to be bigger than 0 because you can't have the square root of a negative number and I need to come up with a general solution. So dt dp is 1 on k, 1 on root p, which means t is the integral of 1 on k, p to the negative a half dp. So t equals 1 on k, p to the half, divided by half, which is times by 2, plus some constant c. So t equals 2 on k, root p, plus c. And that can be a general solution. Or I can say that k on 2, t minus c squared equals p. square root of p, p equals k squared, k minus c squared on 4, as being the general solution. So that's part A and part B done. I can now use this information, so p equals k squared on 4, t minus c all squared, to come up with um, the population after 10 years and sketch the graph. Find my function. I've put in my conditions of 15,000 when t is 0 and 13,500 when t is 5 and it's given me a range of values of c and k. I can ignore the k values that are positive. So um, it gave me these exact values so I turn these into decimal. I've taken the first one, which is 2.56 and k equals negative 95, and while that matches the model, it's not going to be a decaying situation over a period of time. So my next set of values is a positive k value, that's no good. My next set of values is c equals 97.43. And k equals negative 2.51. And if I take that, drag and drop, I'm pretty happy with that. So if I do analysis, g solve y intercept, that should give me 1500 or thereabouts. See, I rounded. Um, and if I'm looking for analysis g solve y calc when x equals 5, then that gives me my 13,500. So, and I'm interested in that given x equals 10. And it would bring curves the curve I want. Analysis to solve minimum for the green one. And it will tell me it's at 97. So if I'm looking for the y-intercept, the x-intercept of this, should it equal to 0 and solve for x. So 
it's going to be a graph which is that uh, what was it again uh, 50 plus 15 root 10 50 plus 15 root 10 T P and that's the graph that we're looking for.